My name is Lawrence Grazier. I compose classical music. I'm a figurative composer. So I write down in music what I perceive. At the moment I'm working on a clarinet concerto. I uh, started writing this in April and I've almost finished the first movement. At first I thought it might be chamber music. I didn't know what it was going to be, but by the time I was adding drums, I realized it was going to be an orchestral piece and, and for the clarinet. Whether I'm at the studio or not, I do compose every single day. And uh, when I come to the uh, studio, I'll set a timer for half an hour. I'll do half an hour of composing. Then I'll set another timer and maybe do some admin or a break or have a coffee. And I go on like that through the day. Musical inspiration seems to work um, like, like organic growth. So gradually tunes come. As I write them down, more comes. Like if you're walking up a hill, you'll then see new landscapes. You might think you've got to the top, but then you see there's a lot further to go. I used to work in the computing field, and it, it just so happens to be perfect for my work as a composer now. I was enabled to do this kind of work technically until quite recently. I'm not, uh, I'm not a very good musician. I can play the piano quite slowly. I can't play the music that I write. So I'm a composer rather than a musician. But now the computer skills I, I developed over many years, plus the technology that's become available over the last two or three years means that I, I can accomplish what I wanted. It is amazing. I can write for the full orchestra. You can hear triangles here. And, uh, but the interesting thing is that all those instruments are simulations of things created by human beings. And all those instruments took hundreds of years to perfect. So as a child, I always had music coming into my mind. I was always discouraged at school and uh, you know, in later education from developing it, but I always pushed. I taught myself music notation from a book. So, uh, Yes, it's always been in me, and uh, there's now the technology available to get it out of me.